A bustling business corridor in Las Cruces is now marked by broken windows, vandalism, and property crime. ABC 7 continues its coverage of the troubled El Paseo corridor. Business owners are blaming tenants of a local motel for damaging their property. And today, that motel owner told Kate Beery they need to prove it. She reports from Las Cruces with our New Mexico Mobile Newsroom. The city of Las Cruces has ordered the Kilby Motel to operate at a reduced capacity because the mayor says parts of the building don't meet the city's occupancy standards. In the meantime, the owner of the Kilby is responding to allegations that his tenants commit crimes in the area. A woman repeatedly strikes the window of an SUV. A man throws a rock through the window of this daycare, grabs a teddy bear and walks away. They're coming from the Kilby. Debbie Caldwell walked into her daycare to discover the broken window. We heard screaming and yelling. ABC 7's news operations manager Tom Scott saw the damage, inviting the mayor, city manager, police chief, and his team to visit the area surrounding the Kilby Motel. We can't just target one particular business, but we can not protect, uh, protect a particular area. This thing has been on our radar for so long. We know it's a problem. The city not only ordered the motel to reduce operations because of unfit living conditions, the police department has placed 24-7 surveillance in the troubled alleyway south of the motel, according to Chief Miguel Dominguez. It's concerning to us that we're putting resources uh, constantly in the area. Hi, is this Rosendo? Yes. In Spanish, the owner, Rosendo Reyes, told me that crime along El Paseo is everybody's problem, not just his. He said he hasn't seen any drugs on the property and that business owners need to show proof that the vandals committing crimes are his tenants. Drugs, homeless people, just... This woman did not want to be identified, but praised the new owner for improving security. People just like break into the building all the time, but the new owner, he's actually doing a really good job. The owner said he's trying to improve conditions at the hotel that he only recently acquired. He said parts of it, in his words, were deteriorating. Reporting in Las Cruces with our New Mexico Mobile Newsroom, Kate Beery, ABC 7.